Hello folks, today I thought I'd do a little feature presentation on a little gizmo I picked up quite a few years ago, uh, primarily for measuring two-stroke oil. I do a lot of work on two-strokes, uh, and though many of them do have oil injection, not all of them do, especially the smaller equipment, string trimmers, chainsaws, etc. Picked up this measuring unit uh, to help me with the pre-mixing. That's essentially what it's designed for though I find it quite handy to use for other things as well. I've had it four or five years. I bought it at my local motorcycle shop. It's made by a company in California. I think you can see it there, Camtech, Torrance, California. And it's designed to, again, uh, allow you to mix uh, primarily fluids, oils, with fuels. It's very well designed, it's very well thought out, it's quite simple. Obviously it has this little lid here. Um, I use this all the time. Not only is it handy for mixing two-stroke um, oil ratios, I find that I use it for a lot of other things as well. As you can see, I keep it very clean, I keep it dry. This isn't new by any stretch. It's been well used, but I take care of it because I find it very handy. On this side, the left side, you can see at the top, I think that's coming through gallons. Again, keep in mind this is designed to facilitate and make it easy to mix uh, oils and fuels. You can see the gallons at the very top of the item, and then along just below that you'll see uh, 2.5, 2.0, 1.5, 1.0. That's actually the gallons of fuel you're intending to mix. So for instance, I'll come back over to 2.5. If you wish to mix two and a half gallons of fuel, you would add oil. You can see there it's uh, 16 to 1, I believe that is. And then below that is 20 to 1, 24 to 1, etc. And it works its way down. Very simple. You simply add oil to the mark, uh, the ratio mark that you wish, designating the to the uh, gallons of fuel you wish to use. So if you're going to mix a gallon, of fuel for like a small string trim or something like that. You come over to this this gallon 1.0, you come down to the, the ratio say 50 to 1 which is pretty common these days and you would you would add oil to that point, the 51 point in this container and then you simply pour it, pour it into your gallon of fuel or however you typically would mix your gasoline. Very easy to use. Uh, on the other side, I'll flip it over, is simply some measurements. You have pints, you can see it coming down, then you have cc's, and then you also have fluid ounces. And again, as I mentioned a moment ago, I use this for mixing other things uh, besides uh, two-stroke fuel. Uh, quite often for a weed killer, grass killer, I have a little hobby farm, so I do a fair amount of spraying, and it's very handy to use for that. Again, obviously, I clean it out well in between using different kind of compounds and chemicals, but it's very handy to use uh, for almost anything. The lid does snap off if you want it to. Uh, I leave the lid on all the time because when I clean it and then I dry it really well, I put the lid right back on it and put it up on my shelf and then use it next time. I think I paid around 12 bucks for this. might seem a little expensive for a piece of plastic, a plastic container, but uh, it's, it's well worth it in my mind, especially if you mix a lot of chemicals or fuels and two-stroke oils and that kind of thing. Again, it's made by Camtech, Torrance, California, and I highly recommend it. It's well made, it's simple, and it's very easy to use. Thanks for watching. See you next time.